Hi, uh, Big Daddy here. Um, if you've watched us any at all on Facebook or followed us any, uh, you know we cut a lot of fingerboards. Um, we cut, good golly, I, I hate to put a number on how many fingerboards we cut. Um, when we cut fingerboards on a weekend, and we probably do it twice a month, um, we'll cut anywhere from 40 to 60 fingerboards on a weekend. And uh, when we fret them, we use a Stumac fretting blade. When we cut fingerboards, we use the fretting blade because, well, frankly, uh, folks, cutting these by hand is tedious. And if you got to cut one of these with a handsaw uh, by hand and you cut 20, 24 slots, and you do it by hand, it takes forever. And uh, I don't know if you've ever been through carpal tunnel surgery or the pain of carpal tunnel. Uh, it sucks. So in order to do it accurately, to do it with speed and precision, uh, we've opted to go table saw. So for about a hundred bucks, you can buy one of these table saw blades. Uh, so we, we do it with a table saw. It's a specialized blade. It cuts the right thickness. If you look at your Stumac fret wire, and there are other companies that make fret wire, but when you order fret wire, fret wire is ordered by a certain width, crown, and tang. And the tang um, is the depth and the thickness by which it goes down into the fretboard, the width of that slot. It's very precise. And this table saw is ground to a precision thickness to cut that slot. So we cut so many of these fretboards that um, we don't fool around with the hand saws. Um, I'm going to spin, spin you around here real quick. We keep a lot of fingerboards on hand. Um, right now we're low and there's probably there's probably easy 60 fingerboards in there and uh, this coming weekend we'll cut 60 fingerboards. I'm setting up table saw right now because that fingerboard tonight I'm going to cut and I'm going to make you dizzy again. I'm going to unhook the camera here from the tripod. But tonight I'm going to cut that stack of fingerboards. It'll take about, oh, it'll probably take about 20 minutes maybe 30 but that's the stack I'm going to do tonight and we will probably have another stack to do this weekend about that same size but anyway I'm putting the table saw blade on here and if you ever buy a neck from us you can know it's done precision ground because not only is it the right size blade but we use a blade stabilizer so the blade's not in there wobbling you know it's in there and it's done right. Once the blade's in there, we've got these templates with all these different scales, different ukulele scales, different guitar scales that we use, and uh, tape that to the back of your fingerboard blank. Uh, you set up your height of your blade, run it through the saw uh, a lot of times, and you go to town. Once I get the saw set up, I'll show you the sled that we use to uh, run it across there and show you a few passes. And uh, then you get an idea of how uh, the fret slots are cut. Okay guys, um, once I get it all set up, I will be back. 